Yo, what up, YouTube? Power Tower here, and welcome to part 11 of Resident Evil Revelations. Sorry for the lag or stupidity of myself. We are gonna go up to that crane, meet these fine lady, lady, yeah, fine lady, because you know the other one I hate, but that's that's in the past. So let's go meet them. Wait, it doesn't look like they're up there. The radio tower is just ahead. Oh no, they better be up there. Um. Dang. Tons of locks. Great. Chainsaw. Oh no. Crap. Obviously. Okay. Dang it. Boom. Okay. Um. Now, how do we get in this crane? Wait, what? Oh, never mind. I thought you were still alive. I was like, what? How are you still? How are you still living? Um. See, how do we get in that crane? Oh, it's over there. So we need to get past this little gate area. Which should be easy in real life, because you would just jump these, but... In game world, we have to find some other way. Like, I would jump these barrels and then jump that. So, whatever. Whatever. You know? Seriously, where? Okay, sweet, sweet, sweet. Go throw her. Don't you dare pop up in my face, girl. You dare pop him up. Oh. Fool. What did I tell you? What did I tell you, Crackle? That's what I thought. That's what I thought. You knew. You knew what I told you. You just don't cur. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They're so easy to take out now that I know how to do it. You just, like, shoot around their whole entire body until you see the bubble pop up, and then you shoot the bubble until it dies, so... How do I get up in that crane, though? Seriously, how do I get up there? Oh, see. Boop. Oh, we need to turn on the power. Where is the power? A power source. God dang it. Oh, see, it's over there. Okay. I was just thinking about turning on the power on the inside. I was like, no, don't make me backtrack. I don't think the game's that evil. At least I hope it's not that evil. There we go. Could be telling me to go back. Go back on the inside and turn on the power there. But no. Alright. Can little girls sense these, like, bigger monsters, too? Or is it just, like, the smaller zombies? Um, alright. Sweet, it's in here. Boop. Hello? Alright. Beautiful. So now I need to go back over there, control the crane, and back through the gate. Um, okay. What's with this epic music? I don't see any monsters. Switching to her. Maybe I just don't see it, but I don't see it with her anyway. Also, I do not know where to go. What the heck? There we go. Cool. Let's control this crane and destroy everything. Here, yeah, let's destroy everything, baby. Hmm. I'm tired as can be in the sky. 
gimme. You can hold on to this ruby. Never mind. Whatever. Watch out. It automatically goes to my bank account, gives me points. So I guess the crane automatically knows where to punch. Yay, short way out. Thank you. Crap. Where? Oh, hey, bud. How you doing? Wish this game was a little bit more scary. By scary, I mean like a lot more pop-ups, which pop-ups don't make things scary, but the way I see it is horror has just gotten downright better over the years. Everything has just gotten scarier. So, I mean, most people will be like, no, you're an idiot. I disagree. But, no, me, I think that horror has definitely improved over the years. He's like, there's no times where I would jump, you know, at watching an older horror movie. Nightmare on Elm Street, you think I'm jumping? Exorc like, the Exorcist? No. The only movie that truly did kind of scare me was The Exorcist Face. Not the movie. The movie was not scary at all. Um, the Exorcist well, Face is kind of really scary. And that was when I was a little kid, and I, I just, like, hated the face. But at the same time, I hated the face of Chucky, so whatever. And now Chucky's, like, the most friendly, like, killer slasher there is. Not, eh. Like, Freddy Krueger's not really friendly or nice or anything. So, why did I go back in here? He wasn't able to open up his door in the last... Oh, never mind. Let's control this. Yeah. Sweet! Alright, genius of the year goes to... That's my baby. You can say that again. This was logged six months ago. <gasps> Jesus, Moira. No. Your daughter's name is. Moira? Yeah. Why? <sighs> hey, kid. You okay? Moira. Hmm? She has the bracelet. What? Aw. The character I hate's dead. Yeah, yeah, celebrate good times. Come on, bum 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 bum. What about the other girl? Oh, no. Next time on Revelations two, Moira was trying to get to that tower when I was with her. I need you to take me there. Can you do that? But if we've been infected with something, okay. I promise I'll catch up. Is this the place? The blasted? Don't be scared. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, so guys, if you enjoyed the episode, please co like, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. Yeah, I am extremely sure I have to buy the rest. Great. Uh, I don't want to buy it. I got a B. Okay, so let's see how much it costs. I mean, I'm fine with buying it as long as it's relatively cheap.
Well, yeah, but I, I want to know how much it costs. Hello, you gonna tell me how much it costs or what? PlayStation Store. Okay, cool. Man, failed to acquire data, really? Alright, so I guess we're not gonna be playing it anyway. So this is the final episode. Sadly, am I able to play raid mode? Please say. I am. So love you guys. Power Tower G out. But yeah, this is the last episode of the campaign, so bye, I guess. Sad. Alright guys, like and follow my Facebook page to keep up to date with the channel. Love you guys, the guests watching.